We have three scripture readings for this morning. We'll begin with Acts 2, verses 42 through 47. All the believers devoted themselves to the apostles' teaching, to fellowship, and to sharing in meals, including the Lord's Supper, and to prayer. A deep sense of awe came over them all. And the apostles performed many miraculous signs and wonders, and all the believers met together in one place and shared everything they had. They sold their property and possessions and shared the money with those in need. They worshiped together at the temple each day and met in homes for the Lord's Supper and shared their meals with great joy and generosity, all while praising God and enjoying the goodwill of all the people. And each day, the Lord added to their fellowship those who were being saved. And from 1 John 1, 3 through 7, we proclaim to you what we ourselves have actually seen and heard so that you may have fellowship with us. And our fellowship is with the Father and with his Son, Jesus Christ. We are writing these things to you that you may fully share our joy. This is the message we have heard from Jesus and now declare to you, God is light and there is no darkness in him, none at all. So we are lying if we say we have fellowship with God, but go on living in spiritual darkness. We are not practicing the truth. But if we are living in the light as God is in the light, then we have fellowship with each other and the blood of Jesus, his son, cleanses us all from sin. And lastly, Hebrews 10, 25. And let us not neglect our meeting together as some people do, but encourage one another, especially now that the day of his return is drawing near. These are the words of the Lord. Thanks be to God. <laughs> 